Hey everybody, Matt here with Backwoods Mindset. Um, we're gonna do a fire starter video today. Um, I picked these suckers up at the dollar store. One dollar a dollar tree. <laughs> we're gonna see how good they are. So uh, stay tuned, we'll be back here in a little bit. I wonder bit. if I have any dogs that would like to go outside and light a fire with me. Would Paisley like to do that or Ringo? You guys wanna come? Oh uh, no. Oh no, she's coming with me. Ringo, put these on fire. Is that what we're gonna do? Right, Ringo? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So excited. All right, let's go outside. Come on. Ugh. Out the door. Come on. We got a lot of green on my deck. Go wash the deck. I'm gonna do that in the spring. What are you guys doing? You gotta wash everything. The outside the garage door is nasty too. And I got tons of work to do. <clears throat> oh, hey everybody. What y'all doing? So I found these at the dollar store for a buck. I was walking down like the hardware aisle. I don't even remember what I was looking for, but I was looking for something. And they had these, and I saw it, it said Quick Survive. And I'm like, what's that? You got to look at it, right? You're in the dollar store. So I picked them up, and it says Fire Starters. Lights any fire fast. Any fire. That's, they're putting an awful, awful lot of... That, I mean, that's just, that's a big word to use in there. Any fire. Um, so I don't have, I, everything's frozen right now. I, I mean, frozen solid. So um, it does say 30-year shelf life, 100% waterproof, and food safe. Well, we're not going to be, and it says it will burn up to 10 minutes, three fire starter. This would by far be the cheapest fire starter that I ever tried to use on. Uh, that I that I bought. So we're gonna crack this sucker open. Bam! It's a brand new bag. Just opening it, and it's zip locked. Oh my gosh! My fingers aren't gripping it. I gotta get in there. Okay, and then inside, it's got a little little package like this. Let's see if there's any destructions here. Starting another fire with backwoods. That's what we do here. We like to light stuff on fire. And I guess you just crack the package open. So this is why it's waterproof. It's because it's in this package. We almost don't even have to have to test it, but I think we'll throw some water on it anyways and then crack this open. I don't know how this works. There's no there's absolutely no instructions on this. Fire it says it works in extreme conditions, proprietary formula. Hello viewers out there, I'm going to take a break real quick to tell you that proprietary formula means they don't want to let you know what they put in it. Back to our scheduled program. I don't know, do you, you think you light the plastic on fire? Just wanted to let you know, you should probably never light plastic on fire. I, I don't know what to do, there's no... There's like no instructions. Um, I guess this is where we start testing stuff. We got three of them, so I don't know. We'll try cracking one open and seeing if this stuff just lights. I got some water over here. We'll throw some water on it. And I don't know. I guess we're about to find out. Be right back. Okay, so I got these here. I don't know. So this is why I guess it's, it says it's waterproof. Oh my gosh, this water's so cold. Okay, boom, it's all wet. You see, there's some water on it. Um, we're going to set it in this dish, which has a bunch of other stuff that I've burned in it. That's why it looks all gross, but that's all I've been using that magnetic dish for is burning stuff. So we're gonna put that in there and we're gonna try to light it. I mean, there's some water in there too, so I don't know how this is gonna work. We're gonna try it out. 
Okay. So we got this here. Um, I guess I will take out my trusty knife. We're gonna cut this open. This. It looks like it's just wax. I don't know. Anyways, can I get it out. It comes out pretty easy. I thought it was gonna be like almost like a liquid. So we did that. Let's see if it lights this way. We might not have to do it the other way, so let's see. Okay, so that lit up real fast. It almost smells like... Um, like lighter fluid, like charcoal lighter fluid. Let me get this away so it don't catch on fire. Um, I don't know. It did light up real fast, so let's put it on a time lapse, see how long it lasts for. I'll time it. So it is still burning. I'm going to flip it around and show it to you. Um, and then we'll talk about it. All right. So it's still burning there. We're going to throw some water on it. Get a little abusive with the water. Put it out. But these for a buck? Whew, I don't know, man. <laughs> that was the fastest. Well, I don't know. It started pretty quick. So you can see what it says on there. Charcoal grill, fireplace, fire pit, wood burning stove, survival. Three fire starter pack, 10 minutes, 750 degrees, food safe, waterproof, 30 year shelf life. I think I found a pretty good deal on those. Um, they'd be good. You know, they're small. My favorites are still the... Um, uh, <clears throat> the fast light, uh, from Phoenix fire products. Those are by far my favorite, but those worked great. Um, I got a lot of work back here. I got to do too. I gotta get that stuff all fixed up. And I got Darcy over here. She's out here cleaning up, cleaning up some, uh, some dog turds. So, um, she got the bucket and She's almost done here, so then we're going to go back inside. I got to get all the Christmas lights taken down, too, which I'm not real excited about doing, but at least it's not raining and snowing and stuff like that. But for a $1 at the dollar store, I didn't expect to find those. Um, real surprised. Um, even more surprised on how well they, I mean, it lit real quick. And I see why they're waterproof. It's because of that plastic package. So you do have to take it out of the package. Figured that out, you know, right away. Um, but it looks legit. So that's what I have to say about that. Um, kind of wanted to show you that I was really surprised that I found for a dollar and I was like, man, I'm like, these aren't going to work. Um, my boy, I'll show you, I'll flip the camera around and show you. Never mind. He got down. He was up at the, he, I'll show you anyways. There's the back door. I just saw his face up at the back door. He jumped back down though. But, um, yeah, so that's what we did today. Um, Darcy, the yard looks great, honey. You're done. So Darcy just finished up doing some of her chores. So she did a great job. She got the dog poop cleared up. And uh, I'm going to go in. I'm going to try to relax tonight, take it easy. Uh, like I said on the last couple lives and videos I've done, I've just been dead tired. So I just need to relax tonight. i um, going to get this edited, get it out. Hope you guys like it. Um, it's called Quick Survive Fire Starters. And I, like I said, I found it. I'm not doing good here. Found them at Dollar Tree. And I mean, if you, uh, super lightweight, I still, my favorites are the, um, the fast light fire starters because they last super long. You get, I mean, they last like 20 minutes or something. They just last for forever. So those are super nice. You don't have to worry. I mean, you know, everything's going to get started with that. This 
if you need to get something, you get dry conditions. I mean, it, it lit up quick. It did its thing. So, and it lasted 10 minutes. It was like right on maybe a little bit more than 10 minutes. There was another fire starter that was in the bottom of that. And that might caught on and kept it going a little bit, but it got 10 minutes. So, um, so that's what that is. Yeah. But I had a, you know, how I like lighting stuff on fire. So I get excited whenever I get a new fire starter and get to try it out. Um, this would probably be good if you were trying to do something minimal. Um, they're really tiny. I mean, that's half inch by half inch. You see him? He's looking. He's right there. Oh, he's down. Ringo knows how to open gates and doors. I'm surprised he hasn't come running out yet. But um, we're going to get back inside because it is cold. Um, here he goes. He's up at the door again. He's the craziest dog in the world. I love that dog to death, but... He's always opening doors and gates and getting through stuff. And, but we'll be back with another video soon. Um, we'll be going live tomorrow night. I'll be on from, um, I think I'll be going live at 7 tomorrow. That sounds good. Going to do a little giveaway. Um, little itty bitty one. Um, I'm also going to be shipping. Everything should be shipped out tomorrow. I haven't gotten everybody's addresses. So if you're one of those people... Uh, please get a hold of me. Um, I will do a short tomorrow asking for those people to send me their address. But if you haven't sent me your address already, I need you to do that because I need to get this stuff shipped out. So everybody uh, have a great night. Um, stay safe. And we'll be back with another one soon. Bye, everybody.